What is happening, fellow pioneers of human transportation? I'm Yogi Steve, and you're watching ESA, the Electric Scooter Academy. Videos about high-powered scooters. Thank you for joining me again. We are out here on the Cabo Mantis King GT. I do have a bonus code for this. I think, I'm never sure, I think it's ESA 100. You get $100 off this scooter, which is already discounted. It's been around for a couple years. This is my favorite mid-size scooter by far. Fully vetted, no known problems, no systemic problems. I really like it. We're gonna work a couple hours on it today at high speeds. Please subscribe to the channel, like the video, leave comments, ask questions. We're still looking for our first order. We've been out here for three minutes. All right, so as usual, as I'm out here shooting these B-roll shots, I shoot them in between orders, by the way, guys. You see, I got the camera. Let me turn this off. We're accepting this 0.4750 egg talk. So I got my camera, I put it on various places, shoot a video, come back and get it. And then I don't, I like, like carrying cameras is a difficult thing. So this is just amazing. This shit just pops onto this holder and it never falls off. So we're going to Egg Talk for 750.4, perfect. All right guys, good luck today. I mean, the drivers are like fucking Night of the Living Dead in there. <laughs> Let's fucking go. <laughs> Super strict directions on this one. It says, uh, leave with the guard. Don't you dare leave it at the entrance. So that's pretty fucked up, but let's go. I mean, this place, you can't just leave here. You have to. Um, I mean, I've been here a million times before. I know how it works. There's a little thing right there. Leave with the guard at the gate. Do not just place outside. Please, it will get stolen. So listen, guard this with your life. Caroline will get your ass. You got to deal with her every day. I'm leaving. <laughs> Don't say you know. <laughs> this is the food. I got drinks for her, too. It's all good. Thanks, dude. Of course, of course. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Thank you. That was fun. Pretty easy. Let's get another one. Uh, we want to go to Chick-fil-A this way. All right, this is a good one. Five dollars, point seven Fat Sal's. I'm just always happy to not get a goddamn Chick-fil-A. Let's go to Fat Sal's. Yeah, don't forget to use ESA 100 bonus code to buy the Cabo Mantis King GT. Now, I tend to overuse the word vetted. Like, there are certain words in life that I, I like. I really like the word vetted. I like the word perpetual. I like some words. So I, I say vetted, and that just means that the scooter's been out for a couple years. When it first came out, it had some problems, a problem with the neck, a problem with the stem. They, they sold later units with an additional weld on the stem that seemed to cure that problem, and they came out with a version two and a version three of the neck. I have the version two. Uh, I just had it upgraded a couple months ago. So, but other than that, this school has, this scooter has no problems. It's gonna be very hard to damage this scooter. Now, I don't wanna jinx myself because I said the same thing about my E-Move Roadrunner V2 yesterday. It didn't break down, but I got a flat, so I shouldn't be cocky, but man, I do love this scooter at 2,000 bucks. It's the scooter that I would recommend my own family member buy above any other scooter at this exact price point. <laughs> All right, you're 100% of the time you're ready, I swear, 100%. Owen S. Yeah, this time I'm 100%. Come, thank you, perfect batting average. All righty, man, let's go. This is to a very difficult building, but luckily the customer's like, I'll meet you in front of building five, meaning there's literally five giant buildings lined up with five different entrances with a double entry code, elevator and entry. But this customer was smart. He's like, I'll meet you at the entrance to number five. So I know where that is. Let's go. You see the big five, number five, it's hidden back there. But like I say, knowing your route is hugely important. You could ask this FedEx guy, I'm sure he'll agree. So people come out either here or over there. So usually right here. All right, let's go call them. Hey, it's your DoorDash driver. I know the neighborhood. I'm here in front of five on Lexington. Over here, I'll be right there. Thank you. I had to throw the, I know the neighborhood out there. I don't know why. Is that Owen? I got you, buddy. All right. All righty, Fat Sal's the best. Hey, Enjoy, dude. Very good. Oh, very good. Very good. All right. Who says Zoomers don't tip? He put a $2 tip on there, $3 base pay. We'll take it. <laughs> Another thing about this scooter, which I'm, is going to sound like an oversell, but I 100% mean it. I feel like this scooter has the best brakes of any scooter that I ride. because It's got the same brakes that like the bigger scooters have, and it's a lot lighter. So it's just more effective. So I'm not joking when I tell you the brakes on this are awesome. Plus they're very, they kind of like bleed very well. When I bleed them and change the pads, they're almost like better than new. 
So I love the brakes on this scooter. I'll give us a lock up right here. Whoa, it really kicked my ass out there. But anyhow, the brakes on this are fucking sick. I don't like skidding out. Okay, another acceptance rate order. $3 for 0.8 from Maggie's. You know what? I feel like, fuck, I will do it. Please no coffee, please no coffee. It's just such an insult to do coffee for this fucking amount. Iced coffee, coffee. Fuck. I somehow ended up taking the sidewalk like all the way down here. It's just one of these sidewalks where there's not much action, so. We're gonna get stuck here for a second, but it's okay. Maybe we'll get a donut. I could get a donut. I, I had lunch, I can eat snacks now. I administered at least some self-control. I just got a fucking Diet Coke. I know they're not healthy, but it's a nice, nice little caffeine hit. Look at this Dalmatian. I fucking hate Dalmatians. <laughs> I hope they didn't hear me. No, they didn't hear me. Cute Dalmatian. Cute Dalmatian, cutie. Oh, this is it. It's just one drink. There's not two, there's not two coffees. Okay, let me make sure I got this right. Oh, I see. It is just one coffee. I screwed it up. All right, guys. Thank you. Yeah, I misread the order. I was waiting for him to make a second drink, whereas uh, it's just one drink. All right. Now we're going down the Willoughby, and it looks like an easy access drop off. Oh, I'm so glad it's nice out. Can you believe it's going to be cold tomorrow? It's like fake summer today. Six, three, five, five. There it is. There it is. Well, I mean, again, with these numbers, like California, trim your bushes. At least every summer. There's so much fucking winter bush out here, I swear to God. Is this the entrance right here? We got a gate code, and we're gonna walk right in, and it's apartment one, which that helps a lot. Alrighty, it's fucking like Night of the Living Dead in here. We got it done. Obviously, there's no tip on this piece of shit order. Of course not. Let's go. Back to Chick fil A. The only real issue with this scooter is the range. It's got like a 24 amp hour battery or something pretty small. So like on a delivery shift like this at in like mode four and mode five a little bit, I'm only gonna get like 15, 20 miles. So it doesn't have the biggest battery, but I feel like if a scooter can do my group ride, it's big enough. This scooter has done my group ride, it can do it. That's 17 miles with hills, probably more the equivalent of 25 miles on the flats. But I think depending on your needs, I think a lot of people don't need as much range as they think they need. This is when I really start to cherry pick because I know I'm on limited range. We got an $8 but three mile order from Chick-fil-A. We're not doing it, I need to get something shorter. We're still at 82%. There he is. What's up, Hammer? What's up, brother? How you doing, buddy? Good. Hang on with them exactly. at the same time. Seven for three, you got I got $13, five miles Sephora, so we're not doing that, obviously. Audi team, now I gotta think, because this is a little different. This is 1850 <laughs> for 4.6 miles. <laughs> It might kill the day though. It's love to eat Thai, which we like. It's Sephora. Good thing about double orders is they give you like 90 seconds to think about it. So you would probably do this, right? Yeah, uh, maybe. You know what, yeah. You think it's a little slow for an expert. You would do it yeah, probably, yeah. right? I think it's just, yeah, and for me, it's also on the flats. The problem is yeah, yeah. I might be done when I get this. I might be done because I'm gonna be in fucking like a little Armenia. I'll have just enough range to get home, but I think we gotta do it, 1850. It'll be fun. We'll see a new part of town. The hammer would do it. I gotta do it. <laughs> yeah, this is a super strange order. You know, I didn't want to reject it because it's like you get hit for rejecting two. And oh, we're trying to make the crossover here, can we? Yeah. And it's just like, it's 1850, it's not too bad. Oh, look at this terrible move here. Don't drive like this, kids. Let's go, we're going to the mall. We're gonna get some makeup. This order is only far because the makeup order is like super, super far east. But the customer says they're gonna be waiting outside for us, so that's good. So it's this, love to eat Thai, and welcome to the Hollywood and Highland Galleria Mall, which I will always tell you fucking sucks. It's a little bit too high end. They don't even have a bookstore, but do malls have bookstores anymore? Definitely no arcade in here. Every Gen X kid needs an arcade in their mall. I basically never come here except I went to California Pizza Kitchen once with my girlfriend and it was good, but it was $100 for two pizzas, a salad appetizer, and one alcohol drink. It was expensive. Hey, good to see you. All right, we got our own little parking spot here and these guys know, know us. So I'm a DoorDash driver. I could use a little bit of help. And I'll, uh, yeah, I need uh, you guys usually do the shopping for me here. And these are the three items. Okay, give me one second. I think 
All good. I know you're really good at it. I know you're one of the best. It is three items. Do you want to take a picture or just eyeball it because you're a genius like that? <laughs> You're the best. You found all three items already? Yep. You're a killer. All right, let me just scan them. I can just do it and bring okay. it up. You don't have to wait anymore. I appreciate your help. Yeah. Thank okay. you. Awesome. Thank you. See you next time. All righty. Mildly neutral student experience in this place today. I mean, I guess they don't want to treat like the drivers like they do the customers here for whatever fucking reason. Now we're going down to love to eat Thai for just a single item. This is us right here. I always say it. I used to eat here quite a bit, but places like this have just become too expensive. Like what used to be 12 to 15 dollars is now 17 to 22. Guys, I have Steve D. Beautiful, thank you so much. We'll see you next time. All right, perfect guys, let's go. So I know exactly where we're going. We're going actual to Panavision. It's a very easy drop off spot to get right in there and bring it right to the office. It's no big deal. And then we got a huge ride down sunset for the makeup. Hey guys, you know me, I'm dropping off a DoorDash, okay? Thank you. Yeah, it's always the same two guys here. They got like pretty serious looking security guards. Here, but that's fine. Boom. All right, we got it done. Yeah, now the go. makeup is 2.8 miles away down Sunset. That's going to be pretty far. Alrighty, guys, thank you. Okay, thank you. Yeah, we're going east down Sunset too. 1.8 miles down Sunset, man, that is fucking miserable. Now I see you. Hi there, it's your driver. I'm actually right under the bridge on the side of the Saban Research Institute. Do you want me on this side or the other side? You'll see me, I'm on a scooter out here. I'm right here. I couldn't hear anything she was saying. Yeah, this is nearly impossible because we're looking for a customer named Daniela, probably a doctor, and this is all just like women in doctor's uniforms out here. I want to save you a little of the walk at least and let you come in with me going this way. Yeah. All right, enjoy, thank you. All right, we got it done. We definitely used a ton of range coming out here. I mean, it still reads 79% battery left, but that is completely inaccurate. We've done nine miles at high speed. There's only really like probably five or six more actual ripping high speed miles left on this. But um, I'm gonna take us, the fuck is on here? There we go. I'm gonna take us back to the center. Try to get more orders. I knew there was gonna be a return trip price on that big order and we're paying it now. It's taking us forever to get back to the center. Oh, cutie, don't get ran over. That'd be a waste. We got ourselves a nice little double from this place right here called Kava, which I believe is just a brand new place. It's like a bowl place. It's a 0.8 miles for nine bucks. So it's a very good deal for us and we get to check out a brand new place. How you doing Kava? It's nice to meet you. I have, I have these two names. <laughs> I got Denise and Asia. Oh, right on, Denise. Denise, is how, it really? It's yours. You ordered it for yourself. Well, whenever you're ready. I've never been here before. Is this a new restaurant? Um, it's new here for this location. Okay. It smells good. What kind of food would you say this is? Mediterranean, healthy food for healthy people. All righty. <laughs> Thank you. All right, I don't want to eat here. It's a healthy person place. Let's go. All right, we're going actually up the Hollywood Boulevard for this order. This fucking weird side street on Carlos is always, always a freaking pain in the ass. I had to dial the scooter down to mode three because I don't want to fucking use so much battery. All right, 6146. Now, if I remember correctly, it's actually that giant building on the other side of this, uh, thing here, or the entrance is actually right here. I'm pretty sure this is usually the where the customer the comes the out. They added the following instructions. Okay. okay, I'm at the entrance on Carlos. I've been here before, I know where it is. Oh, wait a minute, am I in the wrong, was oh, that you right there? Oh, perfect. <laughs> perfect. How you doing? How are you? I'm good, is this place any good? I never tried it. It's great. Yeah, it smells good. <laughs> Enjoy, thank, thank you. you. 
I shouldn't say that to people. Like they think I'm smelling their fucking food. All right, now we gotta go 1645. Hit I missed it. Well, I think I tie up out front here if I remember correctly how this place works. Or I bring it in. Let's see if I can bring it in. Let's try to walk it in. We'll see what happens. But yeah, of course. Hey boss, how you doing? Pretty good. Is it okay if I leave this here? I'm bringing it in a DoorDash. We might call it a day after this. We've only done 12 miles, which is bad. There's still mileage left, obviously, but I actually worked a morning shift today. I got I made two videos today, so I'm already tired. I guess I accidentally took the service elevator and we got a 0.8 miles Popeyes, so we're still working. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I didn't really want to take another order, but I accidentally, like, I feel like I had no choice. I got this order, 0.8 miles, five bucks. We got 0.8 miles. So we might get lucky. How you doing, Popeyes? Oh, sorry. Awesome. All right, we got it. This is a please leave in lobby order, so we do like that idea. We're making a right on Kalina. Where are we going here? The cat. It's weird, I don't remember being here. Oh, but if this guy gets in, I better get in right behind him. Is that door locked? Okay, my, cu my customer says leave it in the lobby, so we'll have to figure this shit out. I'm gonna get you, I'll help you get in. There's nobody in there? No security. Fellow pioneers, we're done. Hour, 57 minutes, 45 bucks. I mean, that's actually really good considering. We only drove 13 miles. You know, again, this Mantis is really good for like 15 to 20, maybe 25 miles on the flats. But I like it. Use my bonus code. Use the link in the description for any other scooters in my videos. Like, subscribe, comment. It's always fun having you out here with me. I'm glad the sun is out today. There's some shitty weather coming in soon. I appreciate your support, guys. I'll see you in the live stream.